Which Dollar Tree craft supplies should you be purchasing at Dollar Tree? We do a lot of crafting around here and a lot of Dollar Tree DIY, so I've had a chance to test a lot of them. So I'm gonna save you a ton of time testing them yourself. I'm gonna share with you my favorite craft supplies that are super affordable from Dollar Tree. Hi everyone, my name is Shannon from the dailydiyer.com. I am so glad to have you back. If you are new though, please hit subscribe. I bring you brand new free tutorials here every single week. And if you hit that bell, you'll also get notified when those brand new videos do go live. I feel like there aren't many DIYs that I do without some type of adhesive and Dollar Tree actually has name brand adhesives that you can purchase at a cheaper price versus the craft store. And my number one favorite adhesive that I only purchase at Dollar Tree is super glue. So they have a ton of different varieties, but my favorite, favorite one is the gel super glue. I'm not sure what it is about it. Maybe because it's more thick, it doesn't smear all over the place. It's less likely to get on your hands and it actually works so great. So next time you're at Dollar Tree, definitely pick up some super glue. The other item that I always purchase from Dollar Tree is their wood glue. This is another super glue brand. It's great to have these smaller bottles on hand when you're working with crafts. And if you don't use it a whole lot and it dries up, you're not wasting a huge bottle of wood glue and you can just pop back over to Dollar Tree and grab another one when you need it. Mod Podge is probably up there with one of my other favorite items to purchase at Dollar Tree. I can also appreciate that these are smaller bottles of Mod Podge. So you can get the matte and the glossy for only $2.50 for the set of two, obviously $1.25 each. Whereas if you want to purchase one of each in the bigger bottles at say Walmart, where it's probably the most cost effective, you're going to be spending more than $5 a bottle each. So this is a really great cost effective way to get a variety without spending a lot of money. I also have used Aline's Tacky Glue for forever. I feel like this stuff has been around forever and this is a great adhesive to have on hand if you're working with fabrics. It also works with other mediums too, so it's just another version of an adhesive to keep on hand. So if you buy a spread of all of these, you're spending far less than if you purchase a big container of all of them and saving a buck is always worth it when it comes to crafting because we all know it can get kind of pricey if you do a lot of crafts. You've seen me use silicone mats here on my channel crafting for a very long time and I have shared how awesome and amazing and wonderful and magical these silicone mats are and now you can find these smaller versions at Dollar Tree. So why do I love these silicone mats so much? It's because they are reusable and you can get adhesives on them, you can get paint on them and you can wipe them clean and use them over and over and over again. So now you can find these smaller mats, which are great for your hot glue gun at Dollar Tree in a couple different colors. So if you see them, grab them, definitely worth the money. If you'd like a larger mat like I use for bigger projects, I will link some really affordable ones that you can find on Amazon down in the description box below. Next up are wreaths. I pretty much only buy my wreath forms from Dollar Tree, unless I need a bigger one, then I actually head to the thrift store because you can find ones that are already made up and just tear everything off and reuse the bases. So that's another tip and trick for you. If you're looking for a smaller form wreath, head to Dollar Tree. This is one that I got from the thrift store that I threw in here, but this is a grapevine wreath. Dollar Tree has their own version. I think they're called willow wreaths. So you can see even the Dollar Tree one is a little bit bigger than my uh, thrift store version, but I wanted to share that with you so you can find these. You can find these, which are called wood blend wreaths. These are really pretty. And then also they have the traditional styrofoam wreaths that I use all the time. And you can't beat the selection of wire wreaths at Dollar Tree. They have so many different shapes and sizes. I even love that they have some that are seasonal that only come out with the different holidays and seasons. So keep your eye out Dollar Tree for those because that is pretty much where I get all of mine from. And if you want to see some different ways to use these wreaths, I will link a video down in the description box below where you can head over and watch next a wreath hacks video using all Dollar Tree wreaths. Another video that you'll find here on my channel is a Dollar Tree canvas hacks video because there are so many great things you can use with canvases and now Dollar Tree has an amazing selection to choose from. 
So this one right here is called a canvas panel and it's basically just a flat canvas. They also have the variety where it has the wood frame in it. Those wood frames are great to craft with without the canvas fabric on them or you can take the canvas fabric off those frames and just use the canvas. So I have so many ideas. You want to head over and watch that video. But now Dollar Tree is also carrying a huge different variety of canvases as well. So if you have a Dollar Tree Plus, you can now find these shaped canvases. And I found them in three different shapes. They had this one, which is a round one. They also had a heart shaped, which was so, so cute. I can't wait to craft with that. And also a hexagon shape. And those canvases are only $3 each, so that is such a great price for something like that. You can also find now larger sized canvases in the Dollar Tree Plus section. But now let's head back into the Crafter Square section, because you can also find a variety of new canvases in the $1.25 section there as well. So which ones am I talking about? You can now find burlap canvases. You can now find black wrapped canvases and even glitter fabric canvases. If that doesn't get your creative mind working, I don't know what does. There are just so many endless possibilities. So definitely check out Dollar Tree. Hopefully you can find these great canvases in yours the next time you visit. Now let's talk about candles. So they have a great section of candles, really cute containers for candles and decorative candles. And I think that's probably what we think about is that we can take those candles and just light them and use them. And obviously, absolutely you can, but did you ever think you could craft with them too? So what I like to do is take those glass pillar candles. They are a good size and you actually can just put them in a pot of medium boiling water and slowly let these candles melt down and use the wax. And Dollar Tree is now carrying a huge selection of colors. So depending on your style or the holiday that you're creating your own custom candle with, you can melt down the different colored waxes and use those. Mason jars. I love the Dollar Tree Carries mason jars and they are my absolute favorite to use because they are smooth. They don't have any raised surfaces on them, so they make them perfect for crafting. But in the past, I have done so many different mason jar hack videos that I have shared with you how to use them for storage, how to use them for crafting, decorating, using them in your craft room for storing water or your paintbrushes. So I am just kind of obsessed with mason jars and recently I just put out a brand new video filled with 50 mason jar hacks and I will make sure to link that video down in the description box because that would be a great video to watch as well, especially if you love mason jars as much as I do. Now let's talk about stickers. I love browsing the sticker section at Dollar Tree. They have a huge variety and selection with so many different themes going on. They now have beautiful embellishment stickers that have a 3D effect. Some of them look like they're kind of more metal or they have corrugated paper on them. They're just kind of like their own little bitty works of art and they are so great for crafting with paper crafts and your home decor crafts. And then can you believe they also have planner stickers too? I found a few different options, so keep your eye out for them if you love working and doing planner crafts. I also love their letter and number stickers. These are great if you do not have a vinyl machine and you still wanna recreate some custom personalized sayings or personalizations with names and dates on them. So keep your eye out for those. Those are so good for using in all kinds of crafting. I also love their rub-ons. These are a little bit more fancy than the regular stickers because they look like they are custom one-of-a-kind pieces with whatever you're adding your rub-on to and they are so easy to use. You just put them on your surface, take a popsicle stick, rub them on, peel the plastic off and you have what looks like something that has always been there in the first place. Now let's talk about their wood beads. I feel like Dollar Tree has finally caught on to the trend that this is not only a big thing for bead makers, but also in home decor too. So they have such a great variety in different wood shades. They have colored wood beads now. And of course the traditional unfinished wood beads, which are great for crafting. So you can kind of turn them whatever color you want or use them plain if you want. Dollar Tree is the absolute only place I ever, ever buy 
styrofoam. They have the best prices and the best variety and selection that I have been able to find. If you guys have a better place, let me know down in the comments below because we all need to know if you have a secret styrofoam place that might be better. But I love using styrofoam in my crafting and also keeping it handy in case I need to stuff it down into a vase or something for arranging flowers or just kind of taking up some space if I am making a vessel of some kind. So keep your eye out for all the different varieties that Dollar Tree carries because I feel like they do come out with some new ones every now and again. And way to go Dollar Tree for stepping up their game in the yarn section. They have a great selection of colors and also different textures of yarn. And they even came out with pom-pom makers, which I love using. So if you're a yarn creator, definitely good stuff at Dollar Tree. So I have a bonus for you. Those were my 10 favorite things that I always buy from Dollar Tree for crafting. But the bonus item here are, I also wanted to include in their wood blanks. Again, they just blow my mind with the selection that they have. I love that they have so many options to choose from every day, but they always have great selections as well with their seasonal and holiday crafting sections as well. I love working with wood in general because you can cut it up, you can paint it, you can stain it, you can put them together, you can build with it. So there's just a lot of things you can do with the wood. So I always love checking out the wood blank section every trip to Dollar Tree. If you have a favorite craft supply that you always purchase at Dollar Tree, let me know what it is down in the comments below. And I wanna ask one favor of everyone, if you could take a second underneath this video, there is a thumbs up button. If you could hit that for me, that helps out my channel so much and I would so much appreciate it. And if you wanna see all those ideas I was talking about using mason jars, canvases, and wreaths, I will have those linked down in the description box below and I'll have them popping up on your screen right now so you can click over and start watching those next. I wanna thank you all so, so much for joining me today and I will see you in the next one. Have a creative day.